Ambulando. Gira de documentales 2009. Once the American Indian lived in the ordered freedom of his own culture. Then in the 19th century, the white man confined him within the boundaries of the tribal reservation. Many of their children stayed on the reservation. But others of a new generation wandered into the cities. I wish a lot of times he'd stay home a lot. But he doesn't. And he asked me if I want to go to any place, down to the theaters or down to shop. He he usually take me a lot, but he drop me off and he don't pick me up when I ask him to. When I want to go in a bar, I don't like to you know just sit around. You know, I like to you know have some kind of excitement. You know get in a fight or something, you know. I mean, you don't want to get up and just walk all over town or something. Truthfully, man, I think, uh, you know, white people got more troubles than the Indians do, you know. They usually have, you know, just, you know, something on their mind all the time, you know. I mean, I don't like to be a fool myself, but I like to drink, and, you know, when I'm going to do something, I'm going to do it. When I booze, I'm not going to sip on a drink. I like to drink and get high. That's the reason I drink so far. <laughs> That'll be a dollar fifty for the gas. Well, they're oh. supposed to pay for it. <laughs> they told me to get it from you. When bars close at two o'clock in the morning, you know, most of all the Indians meet right after two two, and then uh, Indians like to get together where they won't be bothered, you know, watched or nothing like that, and be turned loose. <laughs> Consulta la programación para tu ciudad en www.ambulante.com.mx a partir del 6 de febrero.